what is up guys so as requested we're going to be doing the top five uh, best budget laptops and these are also great for fl studio which we will talk about i get a lot of questions about that can you run it and yes you can run it on uh most of these laptops but it has to be the 32-bit version and not the 64-bit version uh just to get the best performance but first off is the acer convertible 2-in-1 laptop this is an excellent laptop especially for people who are into drawing as well so if you like to draw and stuff this does support uh, the touchscreen and stylus support so if you want to get into that and it comes at a very cheap price right now at 269 uh, it's got a premium design as you can see it's a metal design so not plastic it looks very very nice and like I said you can use it in tent mode you can use it in tablet mode so you this is really great for watching videos as well so it is an 11.6 inch laptop uh, so it is a little on the small side so this is more ideal for like school and stuff like that because it's small you can put it in a book bag and it's also 1080p which is really nice so it's not 720p full 1080p which is really nice so you get to enjoy all your content in sort of you know high res and you also have four gigs of ram of course this is a windows laptop only 32 gigs of storage but you do have expandable storage on here so you can take advantage of that uh, which is really nice the keyboard on here is one of those chiclet style keyboards uh, which is fine i have a lot of you know laptops with chiclet style keyboard um if you have like big hands then you might want to consider getting a bigger laptop because like i said this is kind of on the more compact side but overall this is an excellent uh, excellent pick for just media and also drawing and stuff like that next is the rca cambio now this is one of the cheaper ones on the list at around 200 bucks the price does fluctuate you'll see it bounce down from like 150 uh this is an awesome awesome little two-in-one uh laptop here so i really enjoyed using this if you want to check out the full review be sure to check that out on the channel it's a 10 inch uh, screen so definitely really compact at 1280 by 800 so 720p plus it's a pretty nice display it's got uh, pretty good viewing angles I really didn't have an issue with it and of course it is touchscreen as well now believe it or not this is actually a pretty nice uh, built tablet it doesn't feel like it's super cheap and it's gonna break I didn't really have that issue with it uh, you do have a aluminum back on here uh, as well and it definitely uh, is a nice little cool uh, experience because you have that uh, keyboard that you can sort of take off and it's very like mobile so you can definitely use this for school as well now the keyboard even though it looks kind of cheap uh, it was fine uh, for me to type on I did not really have an issue with it and it was able to run the full version of Windows just fine so if you want to download any Windows application not the Windows S uh, mode that only allows Windows Store apps this is of course the full one which I love and uh, yeah so you can do all of that I did some light like, gaming on here as well too so you can't go really crazy with gaming but just like emulators and stuff like that so for basic stuff Microsoft Word watching Netflix playing a little games here and there uh, this is definitely good you have the Atom processor with 2 gigs of RAM and 32 gigs of storage and uh, like I said it's fine you have uh, SD support up to uh, 128 gigs also with 6 hours of battery life so I really enjoyed using this little two-on-one like I said please be sure to check out that uh, full review on the channel next our most expensive option is the HP 14 uh, this comes in at 309 and uh, it's a very good laptop and this one is definitely bigger for people who just need you know a bigger display at 14 inches so again this can be really good for watching Netflix YouTube videos and also typing because this is just a bigger laptop and you're gonna have a more comfort so you have bigger fan or hands then you're going to want to look at this uh, it is a 720p plus uh, display as well you have 128 gigs of storage on here you can expand that storage you also have four gigs of ram on here so again for people that are trying to do uh, you know work stuff on here microsoft word typing a lot uh, this is something that you're going to look at you want to look at laptops around the 14 to 15 inch uh, display here uh, also again for music producers you can run FL studio on here just fine but you are going to have to uh, boot the normal windows one here because this comes with windows s uh, you can boot it up on there um, with a um, a flash drive so uh, please do that uh, because it windows s will not allow you to download applications outside of the store so please do know that before you go ahead and buy uh, so again this laptop is really great you have stereo speakers on here you have expandable storage and you have a decent athlon processor on here from amd 
uh, which is clocked at 2.23 gigahertz, uh, which is you know more than capable of being able to keep up with what you're trying to do on here. All right, so next is the HP Stream 11. This comes in at 220. This is also a really nice uh, compact laptop as well. It's 11.6 inch uh, display. It's 720p plus. You have four gigs of RAM. Again, the full version of Windows. Uh, you have your HDMI port, and again, uh, this is a laptop for students and stuff like that to be able to toss in your book bag. It's not heavy and it's very very cheap and it does run the full version of Windows Which is something that uh, I really love as well So this is more ideal for doing little papers watching Netflix stuff like that uh, Definitely not going to be doing stuff super heavy on here If you want to do FL studio on here It will be like the 32-bit and you can't have a whole bunch of plugins uh, open at once All right, so last is the HP 14. This is a really good laptop for a 260 I really love the design on here. It's kind of got a kind of premium looking design which is something that I really like uh, so the specs on here uh, you have an quad core processor which is really nice at 2.7 gigahertz also 4 gigs of RAM and 64 gigs of internal storage you have the full version of Windows on here as well and what I like is that it's a 1080p uh, display on here as well so it's an IPS display great viewing angles you have expandable storage on here so this is a laptop that is really ideal for uh, doing a lot of stuff on really you can type on here because you got the display size and it's a bigger laptop you can also do FL studio on here no problem uh, you also have pretty good battery life on here up to 11 hours of battery life also stereo speakers on here so this is probably my favorite one on the list again depending on your budget I tried to spread it out but this is probably the one that I would go with because it's very cheap uh, it's big enough, it's uh, more powerful enough to do it. Yeah, you don't have the touch screen and stuff like that. So if you're into like drawing and stuff, you're going to be missing that. But overall, for most people, I think this is something that uh, they're going to be looking for. A great display, pretty decent specs for this price. Overall, just a super solid uh, pick. So thanks for watching. I will catch you guys in the next one.